Hello guys! In this video I'm going to show you how to use the single target mode in AutoClicker. But first I just wanted to mention, please don't forget to subscribe to my channel because at 10,000 subscribers I'm going to show you my whole YouTube revenue statistics and growth strategy, how to make money online. So let's jump into it. First we are going to open the application. Then at the upper part of the screen you can click on settings. And you can adjust two things on the single target mode. The first one is the time delay in between every click, like so. You can change it from milliseconds, seconds, minutes in the drop down menu. And you can manually check just the values, like so. But as you can read it in the warning, be careful because it can freeze your device if you put it in below 40 milliseconds. So we're going to set it back to 100, like so. And the second thing you can change is the stop condition, which you can decide. One of them is run indefinitely, which we are, which we are going to auto-click till you turn it off. The amount of time, which will, which will make it auto-click for a time value that you set it in. And the, number, and the number of cycles which will decide how many clicks will it do. I'm going to set it in number of cycles and to 8. We're going to go back. And now we need to enable single target mode, like so. Here, in the middle of the screen, a dot appeared, like so, where it's going to click right here. And on the left, left side of the screen, three options appeared. The first one will start the, cl the clicking. The second one is the settings menu, what we set it in before. And the third one is a drag around. You can drag these three options around of the screen, like so. And if you want to start clicking, we can click on the start icon, like so. It's going to click eight times, as you can see, it clicked very fast. It stopped doing it, like so. And if you want to disable this, we just going to go back to the menu and click disable. That's pretty much it for this video. I hope it was helpful for you. If it was, please consider subscribing and see you in the next one.